Tom Willard, Binder Boy, Romney. Want to talk a little about personnel here. HR, you know what I'm talking about. Now women is like corporations. These people too, you see. Ha. And I need lots of good people in my White House working for me. So I got all these chicks in binders labeled from A to Z. Now BB and Muddy Waters got a pocket full of blues. But I got binders full of chicks now, all sizes, shapes, and hues. That's like color. To put day in my cabinet, after this election, I can't lose. No, no, no. Now say I need a Secretary of War now, or a Secretary of State. I just go over there to my binders, I can find six or seven or eight. They don't mind waking overtime, no they don't mind waking late. Work late for me now. Now I got Wilma up in Wooster, would be good for treasury. She know how to pinch a penny, and that's always worked for me. And Brock and Betty kicks it like no one I've ever known. And Nancy in Northampton got a binder of her own. Got this binder on Miss Susie over there in Somerville. She don't think working 15 hours a day is no big deal. Yeah, I got binders bound in plastic. Some bound with velveteen. And I got binders bound in leather. Maybe you know what I mean. Huh. It's all gonna work together when I'm assembling my team. Looky here now. Now Kathy up in Cambridge could be my spokesman number one. She's married with her husband so her kid won't kill no one. And Sally up in Springfield, she'd be right there if I holler. She don't mind working for 70 or 75 cents on the dollar. And Franny down in Framingham can barely dial the phone. But one look in her eyes and you will feel like you are home. So God please bless my binders on the walls and on the ground. Got lots of talent in there. I hope where he gets around. But to have to actually hire him, that ain't nothing to which I'm bound. Let me hear that sound.